Hi folks, Tom Morgan from Farsight. In the following video, I'm going to show you how to do a cylinder leak down test. We may ask you to do this test, and using our methods, we should be able to get the results we need to diagnose a problem engine. I'm going to show you how to do this on one cylinder, but it needs to be repeated on the remaining cylinders, as this is a comparison test. Before beginning this test, please read the instructions and safety precautions that come with your tester. Prepare engine for testing. Disable the ignition and fuel delivery system. Remove spark plugs and set cylinder to be tested at top dead center. Set tester up following the instructions supplied by the manufacturer. Connect regulated shop air. Set tester to set point. Install test adapter to cylinder. Connect cylinder leak gauge to adapter. Measure cylinder leakage and note. Compare leakage with vehicle specification. Most engines can have less than 20% leakage before a problem is present. Keep in mind no engine will be sealed. 5 to 10% leakage should be expected and considered normal. Anything above 20% should be considered a problem or the beginning of one. To locate a leak, listen for air escaping. For example, from the intake manifold would be intake valves. Tailpipe would be exhaust valves. Dipstick or engine oil cap could be piston rings. Head gasket would result in bubbles in the cooling system. Always consider engine mileage and condition. If all cylinders are low, for example 20%, and you are chasing a problem with a single cylinder, the engine may be worn, but evenly so leakage may not be your issue. Additional testing would be required. 